Hey guys, this is Fallen from My Boss, episode 3, I believe. Um, I can't believe this. What am I going to do? Mm hmm. Whatever, y'all, that's the bag. Let's see. Whatever is wrong. Wait, whatever is wrong. This is what I said. Lexi, whatever is wrong. What? <laughs> oh, um, uh, Mr. Marshall was in today. I have to accompany him to a dinner tonight for a meeting with the big client. I have nothing to wear that's suitable. <laughs> Come on, Lexi, we'll find something for you. We'll find something. You have loads of lovely dresses. Um, what time are you going? He's collecting me at eight. I don't see why he wants me there. He could just bring his rich bitch fiance. <laughs> what? He has a fiance? Oh yes. And he is also a billionaire. I done a little digging last night. I did a little digging last night. Okay. And his fiance is not far behind. Heir to the uh Selton Hotel Future Fortune. Um, so why is he going around kissing you? Good question, Alma. Good fucking question, girl. Come on, let's find you something to wear. Mm -hmm. Oh my, what the fuck? <laughs> Thanks, Al. I don't know what I would do without you. My phone was just dry like shit. I'm like, oh, let me just record because, you know, right before I go back to sleep. Because <sighs> this shit dry, dry as fuck and I'm bored. And I'm like, oh, now everybody want to blow my shit up, girl. Okay, show me what you, um, show me what you've got. Okay. Okay. We got this gothic thing. Should I wear this? Girl, no. Let's go with the classic. No. Let's wear something hot. Yes, this is perfect. You're going to knock them dead looking hot, girl. Thanks, Alma. I better go. Go get them, girl. Have fun. Girl, you should show. I wish they would let me show my ass at this damn thing. Good evening, Miss Logan. Good evening, sir. After nearly 20 minutes in the car without either of us speaking, we finally arrived at the restaurant. We're here. Look at y'all stacking asses. Aaron, Dan, long time no see. Good to see you again, Rex. How's things, Rex? Things are very good, Aaron. Thanks. This here is Miss Logan. She's my new junior software servicer. She will take notes through a meeting. Miss Logan, Mr. McNeil. <laughs> How are you, dear? Fine, Mr. McNeil. Thank you. Uh, can we get on with this? Miss Logan, take notes. Yes, sir. After an hour of, t of talking and haggling, an idea was agreed. A multi-million deal at that. Good doing business with you, ma'am. We'll be in touch. Thank you, Rex. A pleasure as always. And thank you, Miss Logan. Thank you, Mr. McNeil. It was a pleasure. Um, contract will be signed and in the post in the next few days. Great. Goodbye. <laughs> Were you flirting with Aaron McNeil? <laughs> no, sir, certainly not. Well, he was flirting with you. I'm not that type of girl, sir. I hope not, Mr. Logan. Who you hollering at? Because I am not the type of man that likes to share. Shit. I, I don't understand neither. He walks closer to me and whispers in my ear. You understand, all right, Miss Logan. He is so close, I am trembling. <laughs> I want to kiss him so bad, I can't take my eyes off his lips. He smells so good. I turn to leave. He calls my name. He grabs my arm and swings me around. All right, now, girl. Sir, I, 
I'm, what I don't think I don't think this is the is I don't think this is right <laughs> you have a fiance and how do you know that Miss Logan I hope you're not prying into my personal life no sir I just heard I don't always believe everything you hear sometimes things are not always what they seem let's go Miss Logan yes sir Oh, sorry, sorry. Okay. I forgot what the hell I was about to say. I think we will go to the bar and have a few drinks to celebrate. I don't think that's a good idea, sir. What the fuck? We ain't friends, bitch. Well, I do, and I'm the boss. G let's go. Girl, am I getting paid for drinking with you, girl? That's all I want. If I'm getting paid, she's there. But if she's not getting paid, take her home. What does he want from me? Like, I have bad feelings about this. So, Miss Logan, what are you having to drink? I'll have a red wine, please, sir. Detroit, turn up. Detroit, turn up. Hey. <laughs> well, bro, who's your fancy piece? Get out of here, Tim. I don't think Veronica will be best pleased. Fuck off, Tim. She's the new janitor software servicer. I bet she'll be servicing all right, but I doubt it'll be the software. Excuse oh, me. What did you say? Get lost, Tim, or you won't have a job to go to in the morning. All right, I'm going. I'm going, bro. <laughs> what did he mean by that? Don't mind, Tim. He's drunk. Let's have another drink. I'm not sure. I'm not... A big drinker, girl. A few more won't hurt. Okay, sir, you're right. I am, Miss Logan. I certainly am. After a few more drinks, and, and, well, and I'm drunk. Let's dance, sir. Let's go have, let's go dance. Let's do that. I have her exactly where I want her. <laughs> let's go dance. Come on, sir, dance with me. You dance, baby. I'm good here just watching you. How are you feeling? I'm feeling great. Do you want to come home with me tonight? Do you think I should come home with you, sir? Yes, I think you should. Well then, yes, sir, I think I should. Wow, she is drunk. <laughs> wait, how drunk is she? Wait, 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 wait. How drunk is she? This wasn't the plan. Let's go, sir. What has Mr. Marshall got planned? Is Lexi in trouble? Find out in the next episode of Falling for My Boss. That was only eight minutes long. Sure than I expected.